The reason Sean is with us is Sean talked to us a while ago about his own experiences of Sean. It was getting from, was it Kalini to... From Doki to to Clontarf. And how if you're in a wheelchair or if you're a wheelchair user and you're trying to go on the dart, in theory you're meant to give a 24-hour notice and they have to have somebody there to put a ramp on the dart to get out. And what Sean was doing was saying, look, we want people to do a day in my wheels. I was talking about this after Sean had been on and I sort of said, yeah, it'd be interesting to do and I wonder what I... And a very kind uh, listener got in touch and uh, sent his wife, this is Dave Collins, uh, his wife Deirdre came in and dropped off two chairs. What I'm going to do, Sean, is as of now, so what, 10 to 12 Thursday morning, I'll get into that chair and won't get out until 10 to 12 tomorrow morning. Do your hand. Things that I found interesting in it were first companies, businesses particularly, and even things like road work, stuff like that, where people could make a big difference with very little effort, they often didn't. So there were shops that would have a sort of a three inch step at the front and it'd take no effort to put a little ramp down there or to dish the side, as the shops either side might have done. No down that lift. So I came around here and waited under a sign saying lifts, discovered that one won't take me. The Irish Rail thing ended up being Tara Station trying to go northbound, had to go southbound to Pier Street to use two lifts to get back on to head northbound, got off at Clontarf, but realised the lift was out when I had gotten off, so I had to get help getting back on because there was no ramp because the ramp had left with the previous train, got off at Colester and Colester's ramp. I've cycled up Colester's ramp. They sat in a stationary lift, well, doors open, doors closed, doors open, doors closed, rather than ask me to head one. And there's no down in this lift either. It's not that they're out of reach, it's that the little, there's a little guard to hold them in and I can't lift it out over. And I'm, what, 6'1", and I can't reach it. The bus, I have to say, I thought was superb. I couldn't get over how simple the bus was because you sit at the bus stop, bus arrives down, ramp lands, takes two seconds, you're on, you're parked, and the same getting off. Just absolutely slick. And it, it made me think, A, isn't it great that we have this bus service, but B, how can they do that for buses and not do it for trains? It should be simpler to do it for a train. So that was fine. And then the, the journey across town, other than the realisation that south side to north side is largely downhill, north side to south side is largely uphill. Yeah. Other than that, it was fine.